Pongaree became a national park on October 18, 1976. Located in the Midlands of South Carolina, it stretches across 26,276 acres. Pongaree displays its largest tract of old growth bottomland hardwood forest left in the United States through thick forests and impassable swamps. Its wet and humid climate makes summers hot and wet with mild springs and autumns and below freezing temperatures at night during the winter. With rich cultural heritage and occasional flooding shaping the landscape, Congaree makes it a resourceful laboratory for studying floodplain systems and wildlife. Congaree is the home to crystalline and sedimentary rock and is known for its natural features made from bald cypress and biodiversity. When Hernando de Soto discovered Congaree in 1540, he explored in search of new findings, making Europeans the first to settle in. From prehistoric natives to Spanish explorers, they left their mark as well. Congaree is known for their tall trees like the loblolly pine and the laurel oak. Their trunks stretch to a diameter well over five feet. One plant that covers the ground of Congaree is the cardinal flower. Some fish found in the Congaree rivers are the bowfin, the long-nosed garfish, channel catfish, bluegill, largemouth bass, and more. Large animals seen in the park are bobcats, deer, feral pigs, etc. Species of birds are commonly found in Congaree, especially woodpeckers. With Congaree's breathtaking views and wildlife, it makes it the perfect place to tent camp. Fires are permitted in the fire rings of the Longleaf and Bluff campgrounds only. <laughs>